More than 500 million people play basketball. It is a multicultural sport. It is a sport that has no barriers. Sport that has uh, very few limitations. It is something that we live and breathe. And we, we do it every day. The employees do it. Our teams do it. Our players do it. It is very important to us. It is important to give back. Yes, we are a business. Yes, we want to make money. Yes, I am out there always asking people for money. But we are always every deal that we do has an aspect of social responsibility because it is important for us to leave a legacy every place we go. And internationally, that is very true. Because there is no other important, more important goal internationally for us than development. We want to develop the next generation of player, a fan. And it's very important for us to give that community. Dan Rossimondo, no Dan, we're asking every person that we talk to who their favorite person to follow on Twitter is. I, do probably, I do. I have a couple. I have one who is um, Scott Van Pelt from ESPN. I think he's just funny and he's a... Uh, he likes some of the same things I do big college basketball, golf fan. Mm -hmm. And then I also, I, from a basketball perspective, um, I love Kevin Durant from the, the Thunder. I think he's a great kid, and I think he just, uh, he's really used it to his benefit, which I like. Okay. And uh, one other question, any mm -hmm. predictions next year? I know the Final Four is this weekend. Any yes. predictions as far as Georgetown's basketball future next I, year? I think it's still, uh, I still think the path is uh, it's going in the right direction. I think the sky's the limit. I think they've got a good freshman class this year. Um, with Porter and Whittington and Trollick. So mm -hmm. I think that I think it's only up. So I hope that they're going to be a it's gonna be the weird Big East. There's some teams leaving, some teams coming in, mm -hmm. um, but I think they're only to improve next year.